Mummy, am I Australian? Eugene asked. Yes, of course you are, Mummy replied. But Maddie says she is Australian, Eugene said. Maddie is Australian too, Mummy replied. Eugene went up to his bedroom, still confused. Mummy said he was Australian, and Maddie said she was Australian. But Eugene had black hair, dark eyes and dark skin. Maddie had light brown hair and blue eyes and light skin. How could they both be Australian when they were so different? The next day at preschool was Harmony Day. Eugene didn't really know what Harmony Day was, but he was told to bring in some food that his family enjoys. Eugene brought in the dumplings that his dad had made. He sat down on the mat and Miss Lacey sat on the chair in front of the class. Today, we are celebrating all the things that make us different, she smiled. Eugene, come and tell us about what you brought in today. Eugene walked to the front of the class. These are my dumplings that my dad makes. He was born in China. In China, dumplings are popular. He moved to Australia when he was a boy. Miss Lacey smiled as Eugene sat down. Maddie, come tell us what you have. Maddie skipped up to the front of the class. I have brought in these Welsh cakes. My grandma is from Wales and she bakes these little cakes. They have raisins in them. Next, Sanjay went to the front of the class. I have brought in some samosas. They are little pastry packages with vegetables in the middle. My mum is from India and her auntie used to make them with her when she was little. I was born in India, but we moved to Australia when I was a baby. Matthew had a turn at going to the front of the class. He had white paint on his dark skin. He looked very excited. What are you going to show us today, Matthew? Miss Lacey asked. I'm going to do an Aboriginal dance. My ancestors have been in Australia for thousands of years. This is a special dance that has been passed down through the families. Matthew did a special dance and all the children clapped. He was very clever. <laughs>